What's going on, people? Hope y'all are doing uh, fantastic. Uh, I just want to make a, a video about, I've been thinking about doing this video for a while, and the topic is straight trucks, um, you know, your, your box truck. Um, there are opportunities out there for box trucks, and you may not, depending on your area, you may not, you know, want to get a, uh, a tractor trailer, you know, with a 53-foot van or reefer or something like that. Um, you may be just fine with a straight truck. Um, I see operator uh, operators opportunities all over the place with uh, you know that could use utilize straight trucks, refrigerated and you know dry van. Um, you know I, I'm, I'm a I talk about it a lot. I'm subscribed to you know a load board and you know there's what's on there is called partial loads. Um, which is only maybe like one or two pallets going from point A to point B, you know, and some of the places you can't get a, you know, a, a, a semi truck in or it's be very tight or something like that. So sometimes the brokers request, you know, a smaller truck like a straight truck. Um, so those opportunities are available. There are other companies that, you know, you can lease to uh, that have these opportunities. Um, you just have to go on Craigslist and look it up. You know, I'm not going to, uh, um, I'm not going to say any names or just ride down the road, you know, look to see what straight trucks are running up and down the interstate. Um, so those opportunities out there and I'll give you a perfect example. Um, to do, do probably about four weeks ago, I picked up, <clears throat> it was supposed to be 42,000 pounds of, palletized freight so what 28 pallets okay so i had to go up to uh north philadelphia to pick up these this load it was at a coffee uh a coffee brewing place um coffee roasting place okay so i, I get up there streets are really tight i'm going around the block trying to figure out where this place is finally i just parked the truck and just started walking down the blocks and you know asking around and people were like yeah, it's, it's right, you know, go down there, make a left, down there on the left. Oh, okay. So I go down there, I talk to the people, and I said, yeah, I'm picking up, you know, this load for such and such. It's going over here. It's like, there it is right there. And it was uh, 60 pounds of coffee. 60 pounds on a pallet. Didn't even take up the full pallet. I said, uh, that's it? Yeah. I said, I'm parked over there around the corner. I said, can we just walk it around there? No, 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 no. We got, you got to pull the truck down here so we can put it in there. All right. So I'm, I'm driving this truck around through the streets, right? So <coughs> the, the, the place was down an alley. So I had to go all right around the block, right? So then I had to make like a 10 point turn to get this truck down, you know, down this alley. Uh, now I'm not driving a, fr a, a freight liner Cascadia. I'm not driving one of these little trucks that, you know, that steers real good. I'm driving a 1990 beast, you know, with a 290 inch wheelbase. Okay. And it don't steer too well to the left. So there's cars parked on the corner. So I get down the street. So the people, they see me have, a, they can see I'm starting to get mad. And they, they want to talk to me and all this kind of stuff. And the one guy, he was real, he was not very friendly. I'll just say it that way. And, you know, so I'm, I'm just about, you know, I'm like this close away from people's mirrors, right? So then they come running down the street. They put it, took it off the big pallet and put it on a, a little makeshift, little smaller pallet because it had to be palletized with shrink wrap around it. So he's like, well, no, 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 we can stick it in right here. I was like, nah, uh-uh. I said, you had me come down here. I want to pull all the way halfway down the block, and you can put it in the back. So here they are <laughs> running around with this uh, <laughs> the 60 pounds of coffee. But uh, I just wanted to throw that story in there. But, you know, if I had a straight truck, you know, I could even brought my car, man. I mean, just threw it in the back of the car and just took it down there. Um, but. There are straight truck opportunities out there. So if you don't want to, you know, get into a, <coughs> excuse me, semi truck, you know, tractor trailer and stuff like that, you find out what the deal is with the straight trucks. I mean, uh, I'm just, 
you know, putting this information out there, you don't have to do your own research about it. Um, but uh, that's all for this one. Um, have a good one.